Welcome to another 5-Minute UAD Tip. Today, we'll explore the AMS Neve RMX-16 Reverb plugin. The RMX-16 is one of the earliest and most important digital reverb systems in history. Originally released in 1982, the hardware is still being used in top studios around the world. Today, it's available as a UAD plugin exclusively on the Apollo and UAD2 platform. The RMX-16 plugin models all nine programs found on the original hardware. You simply load a program and customize it to suit the music you're working on. It was designed to be intuitive, but the simple knobs and buttons actually perform complex parameter changes behind the scenes, making it feel fluid and effortless. Let's dive into some of the most popular programs and take a listen. Ambience is a neutral program, somewhere between a hall and a plate. It's great for adding uncloudy space to almost any material. But one of its most unique features is the ability to freeze sounds to create choir-like effects. Here, we'll use it to build up a pad from a few notes on a piano. And then we'll nudge down the high filter to make it decay. Nonlinear is one of the most widely known programs on the RMX-16. With short settings, it's almost room-like, and with longer settings, the reverb has a gated quality. Here we'll do the obvious thing and use it on the tom fills. The chorus program is one of the signature sounds on the RMX-16. The five voices are incredibly lush and can be adjusted for spread, complexity, and overall delay time. Here we'll go for a rich chorus delay on the lead vocals. I can't understand what they're saying. I don't understand what they mean. Never realized all this city wants to take from me. The famous echoes on the RMX-16 feature two discrete delay lines that can be used for everything from doubling to near-infinite looping. The A and B buttons on the keypad select the left or right side, which you can set independently. We'll use long repeating echoes to make the rhythm guitar sound absolutely huge. One program is designed to replicate a live room with all of its reflections and flutters. It's best with short decay times of one to two seconds and some of the high end rolled off. It's one of the few reverbs you can use on bass without diluting the mono. Like analog plates, the plate program incorporates a neutral reverb with high diffusion, which makes it perfect for drums and percussion. Here we'll use some pre-delay to produce a rhythmic effect on the overheads. Reverse is another well-known special effects program on the RMX-16 and is often used on drums. It's the inverse of natural reverberation and builds up over time before dropping off quickly. Here we'll add a healthy amount of reverse to the kick and snare. The AMS Neve RMX-16 has earned a special place in recording history as one of the most important digital reverberation systems ever built. It's helped shape the sound of popular music for over 30 years and is still widely used today. And now you can add this incredible sound to your tracks with the only authentic plug-in version of the RMX-16, only from Universal Audio.